Good morning, hockey family. Etienne from Field Hockey Education. In today's coaching video, we'll be doing a numbers game. So you'll start off with one attacker versus two defenders, and then you will go on to three attackers, two defenders, and then you will go back to three defenders against two attackers. So it's going to be from left, middle to right, and it's all in one continuous motion. So in this video, you will work on a lot of aspects in a game that you will encounter. So you will, as, a def as an attacker, encounter two defenders where you need to try and get past them. And exactly the same way, you're going to be three attackers against two defenders. And then you're going to also have an option where you're going to have two defenders two attackers against three defenders. So it's a nice little drill for you to use with your team so that they can start learning those specific aspects in a game and how to back themselves and back their abilities to get past defenders if they are numbers down. So I hope you can use this in your next training session. Thank you for watching this video and let's go. If you have not subscribed yet, please click that little icon in the bottom corner. Please like this video because it shows the support towards my channel. Thank you for all the support so far in this channel. I really do appreciate it and enjoy the next video. So with this nice little drill with the numbers game, 1v2, 3v2, is you will set it up like this so that you can have three channels. All the balls will start over here. It will be a 3v3, but you as a coach, you can make it a 4v4, 5v4. You just need to put players in certain spaces to make it um, that scenarios. But how it will work is player one will pass the ball to player two. In this scenario, as soon as player two gets the ball, it's going to be a one versus two scenario. So he's going to try and get past the two defenders. If he gets past the 25 line or past the two defenders, the defenders can just leave him to go into the circle and take a shot on the goalkeeper. As soon as that shot's been taken, player three will now lead towards player one, where player one will now feed another ball and this will make the three attackers versus this two defenders. So it's a 3v2. They will play the scenario out. You can go for a shot on goal, a goal, short corners, whatever defenders. If you get the ball, you need to try and get it over this 25 line. Um, and if you intercept the ball, you're going to then try, wherever you intercept the ball, you're going to try and pass the ball straight away to player or defender number three. So let's say the defender number two received the ball over there, and now they're going to pass it straight away to that defender. As soon as that happens, player one will go out of the scenario, and now it's going to be the three defenders versus the two attackers, so P2 and P3. So it will be a 2v3 going into this channel where now the defenders will have numbers up and they will try and get into the circle, where um, there's a nice little way of now the attackers that's normally um, in attacking mindset now needs to turn and defend. So you've got three little channels where you're going to be numbers up, numbers down, so it's going to be a lot of confusion going along. But you as a coach, you can just make sure that everything works according to what you want to. You can make it more numbers, you can make it less numbers if you want to, but it's a nice little way of teaching your players how to get past two defenders when you won and how to use the numbers when you have it. So I hope you can use this in the next training session. So that was the nice little video you can do or your drill that you can do with your team 
to just work on those small little aspects of getting more confidence actually just to get past defenders and using the numbers in your advantage and if you're in disadvantage what you can do to manipulate the attackers or defenders to um, make it easier for you as a little small defending unit or attacking unit. So thank you for watching this video. I really do appreciate it. Thank you for all the support in this channel. I really do appreciate it. See you next time. Bye-bye.